everyone, my name is Grace and today I am going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is Water Parts and Walls Fall Entering the Promised Land, Numbers 13, chapter 13 to 14, and Joshua chapter 2 to 3, and chapter 5 to 6. Moses sent 12 spies into the Promised Land. Ten of them said, We will never defeat beat the people there, but Joshua and Caleb said, with God's help, we can do it. So Moses sent 12 spies. In those spies, two people, only two people, that Joshua and Gal Caleb said, with God's help, we can do it. And all other people said so we can we cannot go over that wall we cannot enter that wall <laughs> they're very big they're also tall <laughs> The people believed the ten spies. God said, only your children, with Joshua and Caleb, will enter the promised land. So after 40 years in the desert, it was time. So they all didn't believe. So God said only your children with Joshua and Caleb will enter. Actually, why not Moses was there? Because Moses has done two bad things. Oh, they are not very old, right? that Joshua and Caleb believed God would help the Israel enter the promised land? Yes, God will help them. Joshua sent two spies into Jericho. They met a woman called Rahab who hid them and helped them escape down to the wall. They promised to share her and her family so one woman was there and he she knew that god israel's god were powerful than any of the god so one woman was saying i will so one woman helped them and those two spies promised her that to spare her and her family.
sort of crossed the Jordan River. The parts went first. No, sorry. Three sets went first, carrying up the ark of the covenant. That one. Their feet touched the river. It stopped. They flew. It stopped flowing. Everyone crossed on the dry land. So there was a Jordan River. So who is carrying the ark? Go first, and they have crossed. Safely to the other side. <laughs> Jericho was next. The Lord told Joshua, "For six days, march once around Jericho. When on day seven, march around seven times." Blow trumpets, shout! The walls will fall down. So God said that on for six days, walk around Jericho one time, and on seven. They march around seven times and blow high and trumpet. Then it will fall. Their coal will, will fall down. Question: What were the priests carrying across the Jordan River when God stopped the water from flowing? God stop the water from flowing. Number three was the answer, right? The ark. Joshua trust God. He did what the Lord said, and the walls fell down. They took the city. Rahab was spared. God's people began to take the promised land. So suddenly, the wall fell down. Oh, when I am the Israel's people, like I will be amazed. <laughs> it will be amazing. Because Joshua trusted God and obeyed God, God, the walls of Jericho, Jericho fall down. True or false? True. Joshua and Caleb trust God. That if God's with God's help, we can do it. We got another star. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy? And next time I will read another story. Yeah. Next time we will also read another good stories, right? Then let's see you next time. Bye.